Hi there, I hope you're doing well. Now today's video is gonna be short, simple, and delicious. I have here the Steep Cold Brewer by Varia Brewing. It's a brand new released cold brewer. And basically cold brew is kind of grinding your coffee beans, putting it in a cloth or a mesh shape catcher cup, dipping it into water, leaving it either in the fridge or room temperature for 12, 24 hours and drink it. Especially with dark roast, there's no way you'll be getting that much bitterness or astringency because you are not agitating the coffee or introducing it to heat excessive temperature. Once your coffee is ready, you can take out the catcher cup that has the ground coffee, leave it in the fridge. Some people leave it for two weeks, but I've personally found like five days, it will be the best within five days. Let's unbox it. Let's make some coffee and share my thoughts with you. It comes with a nice shape box. It has all the photos, the pictures, the instructions on the box itself. You open it. As you can see, the packaging is really good. I doubt it will ever break during shipping. Here you have your steep brewer. So first thing you notice when you hold the cold brewer, the glass quality. It's really thick and it looks really premium. Really thick, even the base of it. And I would say this is a good shape. It does not look like it's gonna fall. I like the shape of it. Even the height, it's not super lengthy, not super wide. It will almost fit in any fridge. Let me brew some coffee and show you the process. You open it from the top, you remove the cap. We deattach it from the base of itself. I'm gonna put it here. I'm gonna measure some coffee. I have here some Ethiopian dark roasted coffee beans. They are decaf. Please don't hate on me. I love decaf, especially at night. Like I'm a really heavy coffee drinker, but I do appreciate drinking decaf at late night. In the end, it's a decaf and it's dark roast. And it makes sense using dark roast with cold brew. I do like those chocolatey tasting notes. So it can fit up to 750 milliliter. And usually with cold brew, you want a brewing ratio one to 15. You can do it one to 17, one to 14, depending on your preference. Basically, if you're gonna put 50 grams of coffee beans, you should put 750 milliliter water. Here, I'm gonna put 50 gram and show you how it works. I have here the new dosing cup from Varia. It can fit 50 grams, but it's not fitting it comfortably. So I'm gonna dose this on two steps. A spurt of water. And I've set the grinder around number 14, 13 and a half. Once again, it's all depending on your reference, but relatively speaking, you want it to be coarse. You're leaving it for 24, 12 hours. There's no need to go really fine. It's gonna be extracted easily. Let's add the rest of coffee. You can use your tip of your fingers as a funnel. As you can see, it's fitting 50 gram. I don't know if you can see it. There's a room for 55 gram maybe, but you don't need that much more. Take the cap, you close it up and you attach it to the cap itself. Insert it inside and close it. There's still a little space for extra 50 gram. You can add more water to it. Hold the water, add, fill it to the top. Now your coffee is cold brewing here. You can leave it under your room temperature. You can put it in the fridge, 12, 24 hour, depending on your preference. I made this yesterday. It's been sitting in the fridge for the last 24 hours. Now I noticed that it's better like after 12 hour, take it out of the fridge, give it a good shake, put it back in the fridge. Just to make sure that water reached all the ground coffee and just to give it small agitation. Even right now, like you can give it small agitation. You can see the color changing. Now after 24 hours, you take it outside of your fridge. You want, you can give it a small shake, open the cap, pour yourself some coffee. I, I really like it. I've always enjoyed drinking cold brew, like trying different brewing methods. It's always good for a change. And now it's kind of strong, but I like it this way. You can add the ice cube. You can add some milk to it. And if you still feel like you want it lighter, you hold your water bottle, add more water and you are done. And if you don't want to keep brewing, you just open the cap and close it back again. You can use it in any place with no electricity. If you are camping, you can take your hand grinder with you 
or your hand grinder with adapter like this the Varia Evo hand grinder. We're working on making a review of it. You can take it with you, attach the adapter. You don't even have to hand grind. Yeah, that's it. The Varia Steep Cold Brewer. I hope you have enjoyed this video. Feel free to use our discount code for trying it. And uh, it's really nice consideration. It's a wonderful gift for any coffee enthusiast you have. It's a really nice brewing method. And I like that Varia added their vibe to the steep like the white theme the black theme the build quality the way you add water or remove it and price tag is kind of reasonable i like the price tag if you enjoy dark roast also let us know especially with cold brew take care i hope to see you very soon in the next video bye